Hey guys, you're with me, Kevin, from gardening.co.za. And today we're here to review this book that we've got available on our website. It's the Gardener's Guide to Indigenous Garden Plants of Southern Africa, and it's written by Glenis Abidas. This is a really great book to have around any garden, in fact, anywhere you go around South Africa. If you're traveling out and in the bush, we found some really, really awesome pieces of reference as far as this book's concerned. Myself and my wife use this in our garden. We borrow in a small holding um, out in Johannesburg and we've got a lot of indigenous plants and we walk around the gardens quite often with the book to refer to the different species that we're finding. So let's have a look on the inside to see what's going on. So if I open the book up, you can see it's quite small and handy. It won't quite fit in your pocket, um, but you can use it as a field guide. So it's got all the contents put in the front over there. It goes through trees and shrubs, bedding plants, and then the references, and it outlines all the scientific names. When I go through the book itself, just to show you how it is laid out, under the tree section, you see here they've got one of the tree aloes laid out over there, and it's got a description of the aloe itself, where you find it, best place to keep it, grow it, as well as the maintenance, and you've got some really great pictures over there. And then they've got the different abbreviations that are gonna be used in the book, and it's got a good key written over there for us. So if I scroll through to the next one, you see we've got a tree wisteria there. It gives you the description, shows you the maintenance of it, how much to water it, and you've got some really great pictures broken down there as well. So if I jump a little bit further on into the book and we'll go past the trees and we'll wind up here at, no, let's go back to here, the bushes and the shrubs. Here is a weeping sage. It's got the scientific name there as well with the description and a few great pictures. So it's really great to keep the book because you can walk around your gardens and just pull it out for references at the plants and everything else that you're looking at. So I think that this is a really great addition to any home gardener to keep and also when you're walking around the bush if you want to take out your book just to see what's what and how to care for it if you've got it in your garden or if you identify it out on a walk this is the perfect little guide to keep with you and also the ideal gift for any local gardener if you know someone who's interested in gardening and is needing a little bit of assistance this great little guide will tell them how to maintain the plants how to look after them and everything else that they need. So there it is, the Gardener's Guide to Indigenous Garden Plants of Southern Africa, available on our website and shipped to you anywhere in the country. So if you guys are enjoying these quick little product reviews that we're doing, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel or go check out our social streams. We've got a very active Facebook page and a number of other socials as well. So that's it from me guys, and I look forward to seeing you out and about in your gardens really soon.